Okay, the next thing is, this is part two, by the way. You have to break this up. I have to record this part because it doesn't work. And my mom's going to be doing this part. Oops, sorry. Making a oh. mess. Here, put those in. And then, yeah. You just want to do it lightly. You yeah. Very hard. Not hard. Just break them Oops, all up. Sorry. Okay. I should have do it later. So, Please. next thing you do, okay, it's not hot anymore. Next thing you do is. Turn the stove on. Turn the stove on. So you hit the one that it's on, which is the bottom one right here. So you hit this one. Okay, you guys probably don't have this type of stove. You hit that. And then you can hit the element size, because it's the because that's how big it is. And then you can hit the down one, and then you go uh, Yep. Um the good one for ramen noodles is Four, four point five. I'm just going to do four point five since it'll go faster. And I'm gonna pause the video right here because it's going to. And then you have to like hit it up and s so I'll put it back up on the stand. Yes, I'm poor, so I have to do it like that. So yeah, and then you just have to mash it up. Or well, you could mash it up still, but. Like break all the ones that you didn't break up still break them up. Getting stuff all over. And yeah, then you just stir it up. Stir it up. Oh crap! This is only a free good YouTube video. You can also stir it up. I'm going to do that all the time. And then after you stir it up for a little bit and let it go into good spots and stuff, like you spray it out and it's all broken up, then you wait until it starts boiling, like it starts steaming, okay? And then I'm just going to pause the video. It takes about two to three minutes for it to start doing that. So, see you guys later. Well, for you guys, it won't even take long. Go take. Next thing you see, you'll be me. Well, the, the steam in, you'll have everything that you need to have, okay? But just remember, it takes like two to three minutes. So, I'll be back in a second. So it's steaming for me, you guys can see. And now the next thing you do is what you did before. You just stir it up again and mush up, like hit anything that's like still connected. Stir it up. You guys can see the steam. Remember, do not touch this bottom. It is very hot and it can give you serious burns. I recommend you do not do that. It will burn you. You might get like a second or third degree burn. You do not want that. And it would hurt really bad for a few weeks. So whatever you do, do not touch the pan with your actual hands. Only touch it with the wooden spoon that you have or anything else. And and you can take the mitt in and touch it too. I guess, maybe, probably not though. I still rec not recommend it. Okay, and I'll be back in just a second again. And we're back. I'm just stirring up still. Oh God, that's starting to, it's starting to steam big time, Mom. I know, it's really steamy. Do a fire. Oh, uh, so after it's done getting soft, then what you want to do is put it into the bowl, right, Mom? Right. Okay, so then you just, Get it off your spoon. Don't touch and the pan. Get, yeah, do not touch the pan. I and get the bowl. Just, said. just put it in there. Like that. Just scoop it up. Make sure not fall, not fall out. Just scoop it up. Put it in. Scoop it up. Put it in. Take it out. Put it in. Take it out. It's really starting to get steamy now. Put it in, take it out. Put it in, dump it out. Put it 
try to play as much as you can, by the way. See, it's really easy just to do this. Oh, yeah, I like cooking. To cook mommy. And there you go. I like mommy. And how yeah. do you... Oh, I forgot how you end it. That's a good job. Hey, how do you end the stove? Good job. Uh, you just hit the on-off button. Okay, so... There you so go. then, like, before, you just hit the button that says on-off right here. Yep. You want me to hit it for you? Now I just hit it. Just yep. hit it again. That's it. It turns off. And if it says H5, that means it's still hot and you should not touch it. Mm -mm. Okay? You should not touch it and just leave it be. And it always says high five. Don't always, touch. It always says and H5. And then you can put your it probably means down. high five, but don't give it a high five. Humor. Good job, Kale. Here. Just put it down. And then, yeah, I'll eat this. you got your ramen noodles. Yummy. Good job, Kale. Thank you. Now, now let's just close it and watch it. Mm -hmm. I'm not done yet. Remember, kids, you need a spoon. Mm -hmm. Then. Enjoy your noodles. I think. How delicious it is. I think you need a fork for ramen. Yeah, you can use fork or spoon. Oh, well. Enjoy your noodles, kids. And that is it. Goodbye.